Okay, so now in the music industry, there's a lot of distractions um, from all kind of things that's going on. Right now, one of the more major things for me that's happening is this pandemic. Mm -hmm. How has it affected your creativity as an artist? It hasn't affected my creativity. Um, <clears throat> when Sally first came out, we had um, a concert. It's, it was called Together at Home. How I, did you do it? I did it on the ranch where my horses are. And um, Say, wait, what? We did that. Uh, what you... What you say? Yeah, we did it on the ranch <laughs> where my horses are at. What and, else is um, on the ranch? I'm sorry. You got a ranch? Yeah, it's just horses on there. That? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, that's different. Yeah. I don't know no single rapper living on the ranch with horses. <laughs> yeah. Like, you about the first, well, no, what's his name? Uh, what's his name, the one with the horse? <laughs> Little Nas. Little Nas. I don't know if he lives on the ranch, though, but. Yeah. But I mean, that's dope. I, mean, like, I grew okay, up in the, um, I grew up in the farm life, like. My uncle, he owns like 900 head of cow. That's what's so up. So I've always helped him. Yeah. So were you hands on? Yeah, I helped him with him. Yeah. Um, so it wasn't like to do country wasn't like something I was doing just to sell a record. It was always within me. That's what's up. Okay, so I get it. I get the connection too with the music. When I said it, it, it reminded me of that uh, gospel vibe. So it's really, mm -hmm. it's like a, that's what it is. It's country. It's like a country vibe. Like, uh, mm -hmm. I don't know how to explain it. it. Has a mix it's of different. It's not music. like something that you're going to always hear. And I like that. You know, I like that. Yeah. All right. So keep going. You said that it didn't affect you at all. You were. At, yeah, at it, didn't. The it didn't affect me at all. My um, team, my manager and publicist at the time, they were just like, let's do a, um, a benefit concert for the first responders and those on the front line. So we um, raised like $6,000 doing the benefit concert and gave it to the um, first responders in Georgia. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. oh, so that's we really did good. that, yeah. So then how are you now? What's, okay, so what's the goal now? Because I know everything, you know, closed down. Are mm -hmm. you planning on doing things virtually or? I mean, um, Concerts, yeah, tours, we're, we're planning on doing. Greets. Yeah, we're planning on still doing that. Um, we, right now, Georgia is open. So I'm always doing like premieres with, with my music at clubs. So oh, I try good. to go once a week, yeah. Oh, that's good. So right now you're just promoting the single. Uh, yeah, I'm promoting single, the singles. The single, uh, Sally. And it's out now. Well, can... actually, we got two more songs that came out July 31st, which is 100 Bands and uh, Really. I saw So we two. shot the video to Really yesterday, um, 100 Bands. That's currently what we're promoting in the clubs right now. So 100 Bands is what you're putting out right now. And they can find it where? They can go on any digital um, outlet. SoundCloud, yep, Apple, YouTube, Tidal, everybody. Mm -hmm. Everybody else. Oh, that's what's up. Mm -hmm. That's what's up. How you feeling? I feel good. Like your journey so far, knowing where you started, where you are today, how you feeling? I feel good. I'm kind of shocked because I didn't think that like I'll have success the way it's going. Really? But it's really like taking Why? Off. Why didn't you think so? I just thought maybe like because you really have to have like a face, mm. you know what I'm saying? So I was like, and um, I didn't want everybody to remember me by somebody else's name. I wanted to have That's my right. own name. That's right. That's right. So. And do you feel that in the journey that you have, you have accomplished that? I'm building my own name. I feel it. It's my name, not, you know. Yeah, I feel, yeah. I feel very confident. Um, we just released a YouTube video two days ago for Sally, and it um, it reached 137,000 views in two days. Oh, that's what's so up. Yeah. So, you know, things are moving. Things are definitely moving for you, yeah. and that's a, that's a beautiful thing. When you see your work come into fruition, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah, like All right, how, how about your support system far as your team, um, your management? How were you able to build that or to get into that part of your lifestyle? Was it because of your family to guide you there or? No, I just like with, within myself, I just like pray sometimes in myself. <clears throat> and was able to get you to the right people? Yeah, it's just like my manager, he just came out the blue. We met on IG. No. Uh -huh. And um, he was like, I would mix your songs, this and that. And then we met in person. I flew him in to Atlanta and we just kicked We just kicked it. And, um, you know, you know, you have a feeling when you know that somebody's meant to be in your life because you have that gut feeling. And then, you know, when those are not supposed to be there. So I knew he was supposed to be there, but I didn't know what purpose. Mm. And so being that, you know, he's in my life, he's where he's supposed to be. Things are prospering. That's a good point because I know, like you said, you know, you found you guys met on on IG. Right now, that's the wave social media. You know, you have other artists, you know, and they have to trust that instinct or you know that inner self that says I can trust this person. You know, um, if you were ever in a position and that person didn't fit into that circle, how would you tell that person? You know, or what would you do? You really don't have to say nothing because they're what? gonna be eliminated anyway. How they gonna How they gonna get eliminated <laughs> if you don't say nothing? 
because it, it, with me, I just allow, you know what I'm saying, life to take its course. Okay. So if you came into my life and the energy wasn't there, eventually you're going to remove yourself because it's not a connection. Mm. Sometimes in life, we don't really have to speak. We just have to just flow. That's true. You know what I'm saying? When That's you true. flow, it's just let it take course or how it needs to take course. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Monday Williams, guys. We'll be right back.